Sorry, it's extremely nice to go to Twitter. Leave me alone, Streamlabs. <laughs> Don't do that, no. Hello, everybody. Hi. This is me on Streamlabs again. Stupid old Streamlabs doing stuff it's not supposed to. Like, constantly unmarking the messages I've read in mini-feed. Or the messages I've seen, or don't, I don't know. Fucking, it's just, it's annoying. Okay. I don't know why everything's so dark. Um, we weren't doing much. We haven't done any bosses yet. Uh, and uh, we're back, you know? We did a little bit too earlier, and we're back with more. And there's a, uh, owl. And here's our non-magic build, you know? Using some magic based items. Uh, I don't know, it's good to have mana, just in case, you know. You may never use it, but at the same speed, you probably won't use the shooting stars anyway, that matter, at that point, so. I'm trying to think of what we did. It's weird that it's playing the daytime music, but it doesn't the daytime music. There's fucking owls everywhere, man. Can't tell if we had a rat problem or we have an owl problem. <laughs> Good to have mana. No reason for me to have it, but you know, there's no reason for me not to have it. I'm not going to need it for anything else, so I might as well just use it, you know? Uh, we're trying to collect shit. Uh, shit so we can fight the boss. Um. I think I can just turn my brightness up. Maybe not. I don't remember. Maybe Gracie did you see, though. I need to kill that jellyfish there. See for miles if I killed that jellyfish. Oh, the fur would be mine. Theory. Oh, fuck it, see. I'm not even part of town. And it takes me a little bit of time and effort when it comes to digging the hole. It's genius, I tell ya. Fuck. <laughs> I'm ascending! I like how when he ascended, he turned into two ones. Ooh. Nice lead there, I completely ignored. Thank you, there it is. I right, should get the wiki up. <laughs> It's fine. Ooh. 
Cross that. I don't want you, I want him. Because he'll have glow sticks inside of him. And then he's gonna be able to party! Party like there is no tomorrow. It's desire to play both music at the same time. It's really just shining through. Obviously, this cave isn't very big, or you know. I can fucking drown myself being stupid here. I like how, to be close enough to this, this fucking thing that I have to, I can dig it, it's not fucking like, you know. Just put that pocket down here, honestly. I don't know, it's not a terrible idea to have uh, water near your uh, dig hole. It seems to be it's not exactly the best. Trying to get them. Look at that guy. I have a couple options. I probably should pick one of them, huh? Uh, I did bring dirt with me. That is excellent. There's another one in here. I can't fucking see you. There we go. Okie dokie. One of the big ways and easy ways to do with uh, water in your tunnel is just do a little bit of that. Right here. Just block most of it off, and suddenly you're safe from all the water. I mean, nasty water can no longer hurt me. I'm free from its curse. There is the water in the uh, cave here, but, you know. Beggars can know not to be choosers. Also, I'm going to drop. A lot of slime swan down my hole. I wonder if they're falling from uh, the, the ground level. Or if they just. Uh... Maybe they're falling from ground level and just kind of spawning a little bit higher in the cave and falling in. I can hold the breath for quite a while, though, you know. And I, I can't hold my... I mean, I just started, like... I only played for, like, two hours. An hour. An hour and, like, 20 minutes, maybe. Let's go for an hour 20. Plus, I'm not really playing a mana build. So I'm not aggressively collecting mana stars. I mean, I'm used to playing uh, damage, so that's why I stick to what I know, really. I'll probably pick up some stuff, try out some other stuff here and there, but majority for achievements. But uh, wizards are fucking losers, uh, put in the words of a wise man who uh, hated wizards. Wizards are losers, man! You know, who wants to be a wizard when you fucking take one hit and suddenly you're uh, exploded? Especially when you're playing by yourself, it just seems like a bad idea. Damage builds all the way. Who knows if it'll work out for me? But, fuck man. No. Ironically, most of you weapon right now still a wand, but, you know, that's because uh, everything else does crap damage at the beginning.
because like I said, what do I need mana for, really? I mean, I, I have like some shit ton of hours on as well. I, I played it a lot too. It's just I'm not, I, I normally play the, uh, when I was playing it with groups, I play the, um, the tank build, basically. And, uh, it's kind of what I used, I'm used to and I like. So I'm not too concerned about, uh, getting mana in any competent way. Get rid of that before I step on another 20 times and die. I don't know. I like I like tank melee because uh yeah, fuck fuck you guys. They're so disgustingly difficult to control. Granted though, they do do some insane damage. I, I had a friend who did a melee build. It was uh, pretty cool. I don't I don't like playing. You. I just like swinging my sword and pretending like I can, I'm doing something because normally I am doing something. <laughs> is that metal over there? I think it is. No, 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 you use them. No, yo, to the yo. Yeah, no, I definitely didn't play it that long ago, but I did play it fairly early on. I have like, let's see, I got 200 hours total. I mean, it's not a lot. I do think I have games that have more than that, but still, it's a good amount of time. Oh hi! Seems you've joined me in this hole. Go away. My non-wizard staff of magic. We'll deal with you, fool. Go away. And the problem is they <laughs> want is what does the most damage right now. I don't know, I just need a good sword. I mean, yeah. There's those like those uh, secret items that they removed from the game. There's also like the uh, the dev items. I remember those? But uh, I don't know. I always had fun playing Terraria. I never played it like super religiously like that though. Like I had a friend who had like one of those um, he built like some kind of really he was like a collector kind of guy, right? Where he played the game to collect every item and kind of thing, that kind of thing. He had like a really big mansion for like displaying all of his crap. It was uh something else to say the least. I stone block, man. Thank you. That can go straight in the trash. Go away, slime. Yeah, no, I, I never played this game religiously. I, I normally only played it with my friends back when it was um, I uh, back when before the Moon Lord update and then during the Moon Lord update, and that was probably the last time I played. When he came out, we did the entire game, uh, beat it, then called it a day. Yeah, just really bad luck with the caves, huh? I drop myself into an unknown hellscape. I love this little steps here, it's hilarious. Yeah, of course. Ooh! Sapphires? Yes. Uh. Oof. Yeah. I've only ever played it on PC personally. Um, never had too much of that console stuff, and I, I did play a lot of it. So, fuck. I have the. Uh, I don't actually for some reason. Why right, do I? I should have the murder a uh, little girl achievement, right? Wherever she is. Never did any of the uh, Halloween stuff. Oh, fuck. Stop! Stop! Sir, please! Personal space! Social distancing, get away! How? What? Oh. <laughs> oh, cool! 
I didn't realize I was playing on hardcore. I could have sworn I was just a generic character. Is that tickets any better? Plus eight, massive, absolutely fucking massive. Uh, oof, yeah. I didn't realize I was playing. That is actually really bad. I did not realize I had the character on the wrong game type. Isn't there like a? Nope. <laughs> I thought it was like a, I could shift to auto equip stuff, but apparently not. Let's put this in like order of importance. Uh, 12 sapphires, that should be enough to generate a singular uh, thing, shouldn't it? Hmm. Right to the close. I don't know. Oh, that nice, nice, like, uh, dating on that. Like, it's just that. <laughs> it's just a date on that. Who cares, but like, I should have really do that on my hot bar. Um, probably put my axe down for some reason. I thought my items would be here. I didn't realize what my character in hardcore. Is it? It is, okay. I thought it was shift, right click. Shift click, even. probably should, to be honest. <laughs> Fucking, I don't really want to... I feel like, right, I'm going to probably die a lot. Let's be honest here. I'm not very good at video games. I'm probably going to die a decent amount of time. Especially playing solo uh, heal, er, solo tank. It's just going to feel bad to lose that. Um, I feel real bad to lose that. I don't think I have any other iron to make another chest. Tungsten is rising higher. Okay, whatever then. Seriously, I feel bad to uh, lose my health, extra health slash, you know, mana, but big whoop, I guess. Large world, hold myself, I'm sure I'll find another. As many as I need to uh, do that real quick. Um, probably should, you know, put those in the chest too. Everything's off of me. Brains resetting hard. Let's go. Uh, let's see if I can Okay. Ah. Uh, classic. God. Reverse shirt to know it's the neg of me. It's obvious. How could you know no one would see that coming, honestly? There we go. Just so I, just so I know I'm a failure. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead to me, dead to the world. I'm not 2.0. Ah, fuck it, man. Honestly, it's not that big of a deal. It's only one. It's one heart crystal and like two stars. The heart crystal is the more like, you know, heartbreaking want want of the two, but you know, it's not a huge deal. I'm not gonna die, cry, or anything in between, so. Uh, I still shift click in between things. I think I can make a, um. Hop sketch in a grappling hook, thankfully. Uh, I don't want the money on me. What am I doing? Get the full stack of healing potions for now. Uh, my torches, please. Yeah, but I don't want all the items out of the chest. In the long run, I only want, like, specific stuff, because I, I was just kind of throwing junk in these chests to begin with. 
And I just want to make sure I'm not going to take the stuff I don't need. Oh. Look at that. The gods are smiling. So I can be shit clicking at normal on me. Fuck, man. Brain? No goodly. Okay, so it'll take a little while. I mean, back in the swing of things proper. And I never surely will. Where is my wood? Oh, look. Uh, do we have any money on me? Oh, no, it's just, it's not even golden, it's just a regular rabbit. <laughs> it's just the uh, star. Make him look gold. Nice me. Okay. If I remember correctly, happiness. Oh, maybe they have specific biomes they want to uh, be in? Question mark? I don't know. Okay. Oh, it's 15. I don't have any a secondary item. Or Peroni. Yeah, I just don't want, like, all the scrap in my inventory, though. Yes, but I'll end up dropping it, right? Because I know the uh, the money will. Uh... Also, these aren't these are ores, not monies. But like, I can condense my money down when I need to. But just I don't want to, you know, carry my money on me for obvious reasons. What I should do is uh, it's gonna be way too early in the game to try to get a piggy bank, but you know, in the end, I want a piggy bank, I guess, so I can just throw it in there every once in a while. I don't mean, I don't mean the regular pink pig, I mean the, uh, you know, the specialty one. Yeah? I understand the sentiment. At the same speed, I will always try to get my money back no matter how much of it, how much I lost. Um, also, you know... I'm gonna end up picking my money up on adventures anyway. I prefer not to have to essentially restart. Well, not restart, but you know. Losing half your money can be a kind of a really big setback at any given point in time, and uh, <laughs> as you can tell, rarely stepping on half a boulder, or getting touched by a boulder is uh, kind of my MO. Also, there's gonna be an enemy dropping down that hole in this couple seconds. I saw him wandering over. Maybe he turned around. Oh, there he is. Exactly. If plat platinum would be a, a huge one to lose, but like, right, it's better to have it in your, like, you're not going to need it on the road. You never really need money just traveling around. And I know that's not entirely true, like, I, I know they're a traveling merchant, like a skull merchant. Ooh, Mr. Bones and his upgrades for your yo-yo. But, like, all sarcasm aside, you know. Yeah. As if I needed, like, you know, yo-yo upgrades or special blue torches, yeah, Mr. Bones is the guy to call, but, you know. I don't really think I need anything from him ever, question mark? I don't remember. It's been a long, like I said, it's been a long time. Exactly. Uh, it's been a long time. I'll eventually pull up a wiki to fucking figure out what items I want again. I know, I, I know <laughs> there's always my, um... That incredible cell phone item I want to build, as well as, like, you know... I just like the cell phone, I think it's fun. You know, getting to know every stat of the game, also just having it in one item. Plus it's, like, impossible to obtain, so, you know, it's fun. Plus, I think you have to kill, like, the, uh... Stupid nymph who's impossible to spawn. Oh, no, I'm definitely gonna have summons on me. That's, that's not debatable. Summons are, like, a huge part of this game. But, uh, you know, I'm not gonna spec heavily into uh, to magic, you know? I, I mean, hell, I, I probably am at some point only because I want the achievement for the, uh, have nine summon, summon in yum, 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 Yeah, I don't know. I find that with enough prep, you know, tank spends tends to be able to do anything. 
Like, obviously, you know, it gets better after you do it the first time, but, like, you know, you gotta do it the first time. So... Hmm. I think, like, I've only ever, like, I never played Summoner. I had my I had my friend play Summoner. He'd, like, you know, he fucking built the stupid jungle hut so we'd get the specific, you know, that stuff. I mean, I have, well, yeah. I would, I would like to get the achievements as well, because, you know, this is Journey's End. This is the last update, right? They're never going to make another Terraria update. So doing all the bosses, getting all the achievements, and then just kind of writing the game off for the foreseeable future would be nice, you know, to have the game neatly cleaned up, put away, put in a box, throw it into the ocean, never to see it again. That's fine. I don't mind letting some people join every now and then. Um, as long as you don't fuck me, I guess, question mark, obviously. But, you know. It's not a huge deal. I'm not entirely against the idea of letting people in the stream join. Obviously, you know, rules like don't don't steal, or you know, take what you need, not what you want. Question mark? I don't know. I mean, sure, eventually, but right now, PvP battle will be like, ah, yes, stab, <laughs> eh. You know. I don't know, I always liked my, um, so, like, at the end, I could kind of, back when, like, the moon boss first came out, right, so, last time I really remember playing was when the moon boss came out. I did think I did a little bit of modded Terraria a while back, but I don't really remember it. Uh, sure. Um... A little, little bit of an issue, you know. Which one? <laughs> I mean, you, it's a apparently a very common name to be a forklift. <laughs> just add me. It's a a lot more that I just generically called forklift than you'd expect. There's Doctor Forklift, which uh, he obviously went to medical school. Uh, forklift six six six, the Devil's Forklift. Uh, a couple of them. Just just add me. It's fine. It's just Alcoholic Titan. Easy to find. Probably the only loser with the username, so. Yeah. It happens. It's okay. The torches, they're dead. They're dead to me. They're dead to the universe. Uh, that's not my pickaxe. <laughs> I think I see... I think that's lead in there. This is not a huge deal, but I want the lead right now. Plus, if I kill the jellyfish, I get, like, two more glow sticks. Which, on my way to make an amazing rave... Really, just a helpful goal. Okay, these are those mining potions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you see me, jellyfish. Come on, get this over with. Ow. Actually, out of glow sticks. I did pick up some sapphires. Actually, we do have enough. Uh, it's probably worth making a trip up just to do that. See if we finish off the armor, but we want to collect this ore first because you know, why not? Up here for air. No, we'll take. Bubble, bubble, down here. Bubble. Oh, bubble, bubble, bubble. Didn't there used to be like a way to change lead and iron and iron and lead? Maybe there used to be a way to do that. Maybe they got rid of it. Maybe I'm just imagining it. Maybe. Just maybe it's Maybelline. I know one thing for certain. I don't know anything. Uh, I'm alcoholic titan. Just a regular old alcoholic titan. Same, uh, should be the same image as my thing. 
I think I know who the other guy is too. But uh, yeah, there we go. See, uh, confirm. Yeah, you have to. Apparently, I've never added. <laughs> apparently, I've never added your man's team. Even though I have a bunch of friends on my list, because I have to do a two-step. You know, ah, yes, yes, this is the person I want. Yes, I will confirm that this is in fact the person I confirmed that I wanted. Oh, I'm on invisible right now. It's fine. I'm just not invisible. I, I don't know why. <laughs> really. Yeah. I mean, the majority of them are people I know. I only have, like, on my friends list, I'd say I maybe have, like, two or three people who've watched me stream. Or I've met while streaming. Minus that fucking, oh god, that other guy. It was just like uh, somebody who became a very much big annoyance. It's like some kind of kid who, uh, I guess he wanted to do it himself. And you know, you know, if you want to stream, man, do what you want. You know, I'm doing this for fucking fun. Fuck off, slime. Eh. I got my magic wand to deal with you, okay? I may be a wizard, Harry, but that's only for now. Maybe unleash my wild powers now. But he was like a. Uh, a real fucking nutbag, to be honest. He was trying. <laughs> okay, fuck, man. I've uh, I've been doing this for I want to say I've been doing this in some capacity for about six to seven years. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, the majority of my subscribers <laughs> subscribers on YouTube uh, they really came from me before uh, I started streaming majorly. Oh come on, Madame Miana. But, uh, you know, I've never asked for a fucking GoFundMe for, like, $15,000, like, this game. I'm like, granted, balls. Yeah. Get fun. Going to become a <laughs> Honestly, Mac, it's not where it's at, man. I don't know. I've had a couple, I, I've had people who've, uh, you know, tried to play with, um, Max in my time. Uh, <laughs> the main issue I see with people who own Max and try to play video games is that, uh, Max just can't play video games. It's not even a meme at this point, like, I, they, just, they literally couldn't play Minecraft at the time. You know? And I think they still couldn't, maybe it's a mod of Minecraft, I don't know why specifically, but, you know. I've not been a big fan of Apple, and uh, Apple's not a big fan of good fun, you know. Oh yeah, no, they. Uh, I think it was maybe a modded version of Minecraft, and that's why they had so much of an issue. But uh, I remember she had an issue playing Minecraft. I was, I'm fairly sure it was a regular one, but it might have been modded. My memory is, uh, how you say, not very good. God. Am I just the unluckiest guy in the universe, or are there no caves in this game? Oh, I can't hit M. That's right. Doing this. I don't know. Again, I'm really a big fan of Apple products, and I play a lot of computer games. So uh, having a Mac would be a, a very big setback for me. Come on. I'm probably like maybe a quarter of the way to the abyss at this point, and I still haven't found a damn game. A lot of, uh, a lot of ore, though, thankfully. I can't say ore right now. Because, honestly, it's, a, uh, it's... You know, for lack of a better term, it's triggering me. I'm not, I'm not, like, some kind of tumblerina who needs to, you know, be careful with their words. But I watched a, uh, very cursed old video. And, uh, it, it brought back some very bad memories. 
of the term or and the responding uh, the responding term of or what, which uh, you know, like about time. I've only been digging down for like you know. <laughs> Au contraire. Au contraire. <laughs> Tear my soul out, father. Oh, look, a bat! <laughs> I think it's the fat bats that drop the uh, special item I want. <laughs> How's that cave for you? Bam. <laughs> uh, man. I knew it was too good to be true. Is that, is that crimson over there? Demon Ore doesn't spawn in the game until you kill the first boss, right? That's where I can <laughs> get up on my, my baby stool. You can reach higher. I love that. <laughs> it's hilarious. It's, that, it's like, you know, the thought of carrying a stool around everywhere to just pop up when I... Oh, can't reach. Put the stool up. Am I in the underground jungle? There shouldn't be piranhas in here, right? Ouchie, where'd you come from? He literally leaped out of nothingness. <laughs> that boy just summoned himself. Oh my. You two fish. Yeah? They can't just shout like I've done it without, you know. Specifying what? Sure, man. Good luck. <laughs> Caves. God, I, I'm so not used to these songs anymore. Like, I know I should recognize the song, probably. Probably should in here, to be honest. Eh. You know what? If I had to say, I'd say it worked out A-OK. -okay. <laughs> so unenthusiastic about it. If I had to say, it went pretty okay. It's like, um... It honestly sounds like I'm part of, like, a, uh... Part of like a company training video, and they haven't really paid me enough to be a part of the company training video, but they expect me to, you know, put some enthusiasm into that aforementioned company training video. Because, you know, no one likes to be at work, right? You know? Especially if you're doing like minimum wage jobs. If you're doing like a job which isn't like your dream job, you don't want to be at work. And things like, you know, jobs that aren't like really cool. What is that on the map? Oh, is that just the spawn point? Okay, I've never seen a spawn something before. Look at this now. Sapphire hook. It is. Deep. Okay, got a hook. It's pretty good. I don't want to use to travel. That's fine. I thought I. Oh, <laughs> yes. New character. Who is this? See, I thought I traveled further down the map. Why don't I know what's over there? You know. It doesn't really have the, uh... Turn lad. Oh, let's just... Nope. Wrong... Button. What did you even put in here? Lead. 
didn't really make a difference what I put on the last item. I do think... Right, I should probably just open the wiki, because I'm going to need the... Uh, do I still have it saved on my hotbar? I wonder. I do not. I used to, though. Okay, that's right. So instead of fighting the Eater of Worlds, the cool one, we have to fight the Brain of Cthulhu. Uh, Eye of Cthulhu is what we need to fight as well, but I don't really have the ability to do it right now. It's almost nighttime, but we can go back and do everything. I sort of think I, if I, even if I tried to summon him, I think it'd just be a shit show, really. Uh, no really better way to put that, you know? Acts of collecting. I guess, you know, the axe does collect, and I'm being a bit of a sarcastic asshole about it, but, you know. It's kind of my job? Not really. But, you know. It's how I choose to betray my job. My map's uh, spawning generation, really. It's not amazing. I gotta make sure to get some good gear. I don't want to, uh. I don't wanna be stuck in yield and, uh. I just don't wanna fight. The, I don't wanna summon the eye and lose into either daylight or death. So. He will be a little bit cautious. Maybe make a boss arena. That's something I've never done before. Hey, that's so nice though. I'm pretty sure they drop something I want. Maybe they drop like a jeep. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's the snails. Is that like a rat or a bat or... Oh, this guy's fun. Okay. Quick question. If you're going to reduce the damage they receive, why not... Why lower their health so that they take essentially the same amount of damage? Like, I guess it's fun to consider that the snail might take less damage but has less health, but the same speed... Why? Ooh, sailed. I, I, I laugh. Oh, I, I laugh. I make a shitty fucking comments, but isn't silt used to uh, spawn that dinosaur egg? It's one of my favorite pets. I like dinosaurs. Dinosaurs are cool. Here comes the world's less en least enthusiastic slime. Or the worm. But that first mist was really something else. That second mist also was pretty good. I feel bad for the guy. Because, uh, you know. I'm not even trying to kill him. Back book is back, boy, boy! And it's mackier than ever. Is this possibly a near spawn in my house? So sometimes it's nice to have a uh, demon altar spawn near your house. It's just nice, man. It's just nice. That'd be nice. Maybe there's just less travel for uh, the constant need to use a demon altar fairly early game.
Ah. No, I have to keep my name consistent. For no reason, specifically. Well, whatever this shit is, I can't fucking break it. We'll go around it. Slime really wants in. Huh, no, he's got in. Is that like a pile of gold? Pretty nice. Still not what I'm looking for. Also, I think this is like... What is this? Oh, cool. Another sp spin snail. Is that a fucking fairy? What's with this fairy? Down the hole now. Bye, spin snail. You will be not missed. <laughs> Let the fairy out of there. Set, set my fairy free. Did, I don't know, man. It just it just came out of nowhere. It just he flew through the wall. I was standing. I came over here, dude. This snail is either very like. determined or just an idiot I don't know the, the fairy came flying through the wall I have no clue where he came from I've never seen this fairy in my life before um, I don't know what it does I don't know what it is I I just saw light coming through the wall and it was this fairy I tried to murder it first to be honest so kind of monster One second. Sorry about the uh, disappearance for a second. <laughs> Topaz. I don't know. Does people like Topaz? Is that a birthstone? I don't even fucking believe in that. Believe in TM, you know, like, what, what is there to believe in when it comes to the topic of birthstones? But I guess there's sim uh, some. Jeez Louise, I could have died. I need a better sword. I'm guessing, right? And this is a shot in the dark because I have no clue. And uh, I'm about to look it up. Okay, maybe not. I would say maybe when the fairy die, when I die, the fairy would like save me. It's just do myself a favor here. Come on, you fairy, calm down. I, I was thinking that maybe it was like, what if I died, it would res me? Instead of having me die, like a Legend of Zelda. <gasps> it found a life crystal. Does it point out treasures? It seems to be drifting towards it. Oh, 
Oh, it's dead now. Well, now we know what the fairy does, I guess. It leads you to treasure. But once. <laughs> After that, it becomes it's overcome with such an amount of glee that it explodes. Mr. Bat, I see you. I know you're there. You can't hide from me. Though I guess he can't. Oh, she's there he is. Nice. murder fest going on over there. I don't want to get involved in whatever mess that's going on. Jesus, who is that guy? He might look just terrible. I don't know, it's ha habitual to try to put down as, as few torches as possible. But we don't really have a way to generate light yet, so... Once we are no longer require light, that is when the uh, torches shall go. There will be a time, I'm assuming. I remember there. I remember never putting torches down in the end. Wait, bat. He lives inside of my butt. He's a butt bat. He's Batman's flamboyant cousin, butt bat hit that so I don't explode to at least a million pieces. I want to, oh, if I explode, right, I want to either go for as many or as little pieces as possible, right? Where it's like, I'm standing, I'm sitting on the bus, right, riding to uh, where I got to go because apparently I'm using public transport today for some reason. Uh, and I just kind of like disassemble. And it, of course, it freaks people out because, you know, that guy just disassembled. What the hell just happened now? Yeah. Or like your arm just pop off and your leg like just, just your body just stumbles. That that would be uh, creepy. Or like you know, uh, exploding to a cloud of viscera. Just a, a fine mist. Maybe a little bit of chunks. Only maybe though. That spear is really effective against certain enemies. question is how far does it realistically go? The answer is probably not that far. I see you up there, bad. It's the fat bats I want. I don't want the thin bats, I think. Thin, bat, thin bats don't drop the items I want. Fat bats are there. They are fold.
wonder if it's better to craft which which piece of armor is better to craft first. How much that water goes away will kind of help figure out how deep this hole goes. Also, there's a lot of stuff going on here. I want to say silver's probably better. We should probably um think about upgrading our pickaxe. To be honest, it'd be nice to mine just even slightly faster. Is that more? That's grass up there. I think it's not my sapphire. I'm gonna make a lightsaber later. I think it's part of one of the bigger weapons. all that water disappeared nicely, which means this hole goes at least that much deeper. By that much deeper, I mean literally just that much deeper. God. I think we actually might have to go to pickaxe, and a pickaxe soon. Because it seems like our mining power is to start not cutting it. Like that stuff there, that looks like some kind of higher tier ore. Dude, this guy is fucking relentless. Maybe let's watch Bones McGee back here and make it like the, uh, you know, 10 minute fucking walk to Woodstock to come punch me in the cock. <laughs> Sorry, I wanted to rhyme. And, uh, it's the only, it's really only, the only, uh, descriptor I could think of that would rhyme with all that. More Topaz. Everybody's favorite Topaz. The best crystal gem. There's probably Topaz in the Universe, right? So you have to find the cave system I'm truly looking for. Hmm, some more lead over there. I don't know if lead armor is where we want to go. Well, obviously, not in the long run, but you know, I don't know if we want to focus on making a. Uh, lead piece of uh, chest piece or possibly just continue moving up and I'm probably betting on continue moving up. I think I'll use the highest tier we have right now to make a weapon. So they're the best move to make. Focus on making armor from the uh, next available. I also used to have, like uh, Stardews, not Stardews. I keep saying Stardew when I mean Starbound. But I haven't really stayed Starbound in a long time as well. Mainly because, uh, you know, all those fake update notes and whatnot. Or rather, the bounty hunter upgrade, which would, you know. Ooh! Forget this nonsense. Let me go back to the time. Oh, fuck, man. 
and apparently I have none of my potions on me. It's kind of annoying. What happened to them all? I guess I just left them in the chest. I thought I picked them up. Got them with. I guess I should think again. Can I stop being stuck? Is that the hands? I'm not going up through death, you bastards! You wicked beasts! Isn't there like a control click to place down a torch or something? Isn't there like right clicking with a, uh, no. Again, I might be thinking of a different game, but I could have sworn there was like some special way to like place torches down with uh, other items equipped. I may be misremembering. I could just want to pick up those potions, too. I don't know what's up with me today. And every day. Wah, wah. The worm's coming. Watch out. Watch out. He's on his way. Oh no. Merchant boy, what do you got for me today? If you're looking for junk, you've come to the right place. No. See your skin. Active. Actuator's unplaced. What the fuck's an actuator? Is it like 11 gold? One platinum. I think they don't have that yet. God. I only want it because it's so expensive. <laughs> it's not even valuable, it's just, you know. Why wouldn't I want some kind of weird collectible item that was worth one whole gold? Uh, I do want a bug net. We're gonna need one eventually. <sighs> I like that fucking kind of fox thing. I don't like foxes. I'm not a furry, I swear! <laughs> All uh, jokes aside, <laughs> I am not a furry. It's fine. Let's start, let's start off with that. It's true, you heard right. I am not a furry. If you're here for furry-based content, uh, well, you've come to the wrong place, trust me. Uh, go find somebody else. <laughs> really. Get out of here, you fucking monster. Okay, uh, a lot of lead. Enough to poison a whole school. <laughs> Okay, so we have the option of making a lead with broadswords that we want. Or we can make a silver broadsword, which is the exact, no, less. Ooh. 11 minute damage, and then the last three, that way. Well, if the swords are the same. in the armor. I should check the gold one. No, it's like two more damage. Uh, but I could get a... I think I actually need this. 
they need to, they need to mind me right I think Seymour or for Dodd and Seymour Um, brain is farting a little bit. It's ever so slightly daily and nightly in little ways. Everything stays. Um, I wonder if we should, you know, we'll use this knife. Just because, uh, we want to collect some eyeball, little eyeball things. Get on out of my eye holes! We need a... We can cut some hearts, we can cut some eye lenses. I don't know what else you need for them though. We need to kill eyeballs. Oh, I guess Prana spawned in the desert? I think that's Prana. It's like fucking gooses when you die. Uh, non accurate vulture death noises? That's uh, gotta be a star off for me. A dog. Did I just land on that slime? Probably should be sure to cut. I'm gonna need some range, and I don't know if I'm probably. It's gonna probably end up being um. Gun slash bow based, but uh, time being, I think we got to oh, we actually ran out of torches. Let's do this stupid double clicking again. Should have worked on the pole too. <laughs> Ripperoni. I don't remember anything I've done. I know I've done it, gone in both these directions to some extent. I know left I've stopped at the crimson. Uh, the right I even saw the crimson, so. Two lenses, pretty good. Uh, zombie in the water. Mm -hmm. Based on how this fight, these fights are going, I, I think uh, we're probably going to want to look for a uh, better weapon. <laughs> Space in my inventory? Thank you, game.
And it's not terrible to pick up the uh, mana specifically for uh, range attacks right now. I mean, we will kind of run into a little bit of an issue when it comes to uh, hitting things. Because uh, a lot of stuff like stays out of range. It shouldn't be too much of an issue in the long run, but, you know, having a secondary option. One might even call it a backup. <laughs> so, uh, this seems like a good idea. You know? I just want to have the option available to me when I feel like I'm ready to uh, take on the boss, to take on the boss, you know? Talking lens now is uh, a good option. A good, uh, good way. Good thing. It's good. It's good to always have the option available, okay? You know? Well, have you ever asked yourself, what am I doing? Fucking demon life? God. Just there. Oh boy, was that a shackle I picked up? Oh boy. Shackle giving me like a. Yeah. It's a little bit of extra defense. Why not? So. Uh, well, actually, you know what? It also has the plus 4% movement speed buff on it. So it's pretty good. I must say, one of the better shackles I've worn in uh, recent history. that I, uh, you know, wear that many shackles, but, you know. I'm gonna get clear. I'm not a shackle fetishist, okay? I know those guys are terrible. Horrible. The worst people you meet on Earth. Almost as bad as Wonder Bread guys. Guy. Only one of them. He is the worst. You know what I'm talking about? You know the suffering. If they stuff so like that is just purely decorative or serves some greater purpose in the large scale place. You know?
Jeez Louise, is this fucking Falling Star Central? What's happening over here? Into pieces. Do I want to fight the uh, the dungeon master yet? No. Yes. <laughs> thumbs up. Thumbs down. No. I'm seeing. I'm seeing. Uh, Thirty thumbs down. God, not a chance. How many stupid things can I make before I have too much? Uh Yeah, that should be all I can make, I think. Uh Yeah, two hundred. Should be, uh, should be everything I can get, I think. In terms of mana. Mana! I'm out of mana! Surprise! Normally in deserts, there's usually some kind of giant fucking sinkhole in the middle that, uh, you just fall into and die. Uh, full of worms. Giant, terrible worms and antlions. And everything like that. I'm actually... I'm guessing, right, this beast area is kind of, uh, maybe a replacement for the banner system? And by replacement I just mean, like, an addition. So, um, I've yet to accomplish it yet in this save, obviously, we have not been playing that long. Uh, once you kill a certain number of any kind of mob, it drops a banner, which, um, which, uh, you need place, when placed, which is very rarely done. Uh, oh, fuck. Oh, that's my name. It's not even worth it. Tough look back. I want to. More than anything in the world, I want to. Same speed, I probably should. Probably be going back to the cave and see if we can get more silver. Silver or gold? Silver or gold? I doubt it'll be anything we really want slash need. And while I definitely do want to check out what he has, because normally they can have some cool stuff, I think. If I remember correctly. Oh, cool. We can actually just go back. Which, I don't think I have a water breathing potion on me. Just a bunch of recall potions. Uh. Oh, the angler. Yeah, I don't really have any uh, glow sticks to. No. Lightning leaf shell. Dude, Angler, I don't got all day. I want to rescue you, so I can probably do a fishing quest in my own time.
I know it's not overly valuable, but uh, on that stopwatch. You're saying, why, Brandon? Why do you want that stopwatch? <laughs> because, my boy, my dear Watson, it <laughs> stacked into a really shitty overall item. Uh, it's not amazing. It's not amazing. It's not, like, you know, great. It's like it. I like having all those stats, right? But for now, I'm going to leave it here. die as much as I just want to get special ones from the guy die guy when he arrives uh, yeah, goes on me. I'm not really going to use the net anytime soon so I'm just leaving here the net realistically for me at least is uh, for when we inevitably find a um We inevitably find a golden guy, also it's used for catching bait, which I'm not too keen on right now. Fishing in this game is uh, a fucking pain, to say the least. You know, like you know, I've never seen it done worse. That's not to say this is done amazingly. Now, where I've seen done worse is a little bit of struggle to say. Try to feature proof a little bit, have two rooms. Because they ain't gonna move in, and then the. Uh, I don't know who's next. I think you need a. I know you need a boss for the. Uh, Druid to show up. I don't remember when the nurse shows up. What is goggles? Oh, I just made a lens. It's probably not a good idea. I'm saying that I would prefer to, you know, <laughs> make something useful out of them. Just uh, grab the axis out of my chest. Uh, make myself two of these, two of those. This is all temporary housing. We maybe I'll either. I mean, tell me what you guys want. You know, if you're watching this on uh, YouTube, let me know. You know, would you prefer having a stream in which I build a bunch of uh, possibly nice-looking houses? Uh, probably different biomes, or would you prefer if I, um, did it off stream, then showed them off? I mean, the stream would obviously have to be me collecting the items as well, which is probably a good reason for it to be on stream in case something special happens. But, uh, you know, whatever you guys prefer. I'm down for either. I'm also down for kind of just building rectangles for the rest of my life. Uh, housing has never really been the most important thing to me. You know, they can just kind of live in a weird block cell of shitty little... Uh, this is minus... I guess, I mean, like, honestly, we don't want to move at least two of them to different locations. Because, you know, having those uh, teleporters probably be nice. The pylons. That are for something, I don't know what, to be honest. I think they're just for teleporting the biomes. I don't know how they work. Like, do I need to have two of them? Like, do I need to have only one...
fucking four bars, dude. Where the hell is this thing go? There's always a chance that it was just gonna be <laughs> a uh, visual thing. I'm fine with that. Whatever. Not a huge deal. Uh, we only have four lenses. We need six, I believe, to summon the, uh, make the Cthulhu summon. I think we should just go back into the hellhole of the, uh, pit. Just go back into the pit. And, uh, really just stick my life out. No. Oh, no. No, he's won't. I want my silver. Or gold. Or both. Or, you know, mostly gold, I guess. This gold is probably better than silver. There is gold at the end of this, right? I'm gonna, and that's also kind of why you uh, thick out your holes. Uh, especially because if it starts at a 3 and goes to a 2. That could have been very, uh, very bad for me. Fuck the axe, just put it down there. Oh. That's why I built four rooms, everybody. I was unsure about what the uh, crimes for the nurse were. Anymore. I think this is the Crimson. Coming out, yeah, there we go. Which I don't think we can refine until we have, uh... Demon Scales, question mark? Cause I know the eye drops some weird-ass loot, right? Some whack-ass loot, dog. Thanks, Mr. Slime. So glad you came to join me in this hole. You know what I was thinking? It was missing just a fucking slime. I didn't realize my swarm was slow. going that much faster? I don't know, probably. Guess it kind of is it's going faster. So maybe that's the illusion of uh, more pickaxe and speed power. I don't remember if pickaxe and power meant speed or not. I think it's just more about the um, ability to pickaxe shit, you know? It's night time, which we could. What is this thing? A mouse. Fuck mice. Let's look at all the extra crim crim crimson ore. We saw over here. 
again, I'm fairly sure we still can't use it, but you know. I'd rather have it and uh, not be able to use it than need it and need it and not have you know, you know what I mean. I like to have extra shit. I'm a fucking hoarder. Okay. It's a mental problem. I keep trying to, uh... I might have to get used to this whole moving my pickaxe one further down. I'll go back on my decision. I really don't want to do that from the back. I don't know if this pickaxe is doing that much more damage. At least, like, it's when, um, I need to get some of those, uh, upside down potions. So this is some um, gravity potions that allow you to like kind of just flip your gravity. Whoops! There goes gravity, just up and down and down and up, and uh, they're pretty good, you know. And then they let you fly, uh, find flying islands. And when you find flying islands, you can find uh, the mystical item. Uh, there's like a sword which fires uh, stars, and it's pretty good because <laughs> it lets you fire stars underground, which light up the area that they fire in. Which is easy to find caves. He said finding what literally lots of the like the worst baby caves I've ever seen. Die hell beast! Go back from whence you came. Take your spawn with you too, asshole. Just fucking spawn a bunch of babies. That care in this world. You're not taking care of them. You're dead. You can't take care of those babies. Who's gonna take care of all those babies? All of those poor little babies. Fair without a mother, because you're too busy dying. Irresponsible. I'll use my terraria tax dollars to pay for your death babies. That ain't happening, man. really weird and semi-political about it. I mean, fake political. I don't really care. Nor am I, uh, really advocating one way or another. I'm just making a thinly veiled joke. Fuck you for making me explain it. Or fuck me for being such a dumb bitch that I, I want to explain it. So, um... So, uh, my phone likes to give me news articles that I don't really care about, right? I mean, they're related to topics that I should, in theory, care about because I've expressed interest on it because, you know, you know how Google is when it's fucking using your information without, you know, fucking telling you and creating searches for you that you would, in theory, like because it's based on your search history. All anti-Google propaganda reserved, however. There's an article from, I think, I want to say, like, the New York Times, or maybe it was, like, it's some, like, fucking shitty secondary company, who cares what it was. Um, it was, it was about Rick and Morty, right? You know, everybody knows what Rick and Morty is, right? You know, I don't have to explain that one. we let you guys, uh, just, like, figure it out, you know?
cool. Uh, yeah, but so there was a um, article on Rick and Morty, right? Because uh, in the... Not the most recent episode, but the one before it, they made a 9-11 uh, joke. It's, it's turned the other way now. I'm so glad we made that. Honestly. Which makes my life. Okay. Oh, we can make those. I can't use, like, Kermitite. Okay. Just wanna make sure I wasn't fucking wasting this shit. Yes, we need the tissue samples to, okay. Yep, Aruno, I remember. We need the uh, special shit to make it into, uh, the armor slash pickaxe, but otherwise I can make a sword out of it, which is pretty cool. Got us more of it. Uh, but so, that Rick and Morty facehugger episode where they were blowing up the, the you know, facehugger uh, asteroid, and then they uh, made a 9-11 joke, and it's like, oh, Rick and Morty fans upset about 9-11 joke. I'm like, really? I thought it was kind of funny, you know, just, you know, oh, hey, we're not going to... I'm not gonna do 9-11, right? No, that's, that's terrible. Why would we do that, you know? And I'm like... I really don't think, you know... The people watching Rick and Morty are the ones that really care about making a 9-11 joke. A, because... Uh, I recently... Uh, due to my cell plan, have gotten Hulu. Uh, this is no way she performed an advertisement for Hulu. I don't care what fucking, you know... Shitty movie provider you plan on spending your money on. Really, buy any of them. They're all terrible. Uh, you know, just watch whatever crap you want to watch, you know. Um, but I wanted to use it because there was that new, uh, Justin Roiland show coming out on it. And my soul variety gives it for me. You know, free Hulu. You know. And if uh, there's one thing I can, uh, you know, give my support for, it's free shit. I love it. I love free shit. Like all those free games I sometimes get, you no. Know. I've not really accepted many, uh, and I'm using this term very lightly in this scenario, a uh, sponsorship deals. Where did I actually... Where did I die? I completely forgot that I had died before. <laughs> God, fuck off! Yeah, no, but they made a 9-11 joke, and then there was, like, a, uh, like, it's one of those, uh, special beetles that drops, like, uh, die, I think. Sitting down here with me. Is that a fucking ghost? <laughs> oh, jeez! Oh, jeez, Scoob! Monster is just more common. Saying I'm not used to having this much of a problem with uh, monster spawning. I, fuck. <laughs> so they just drop off the rest of my gold. Oh, they put a little timer there. That's cool. That's actually really good. I like that. Um, you know, but they may not live a joke, you know. I was like, whatever, it's kind of funny. I thought it was pretty funny. And, uh... Some, like, you know, second-rate, shitty, uh... And this company's like, oh, man, Rick and Morty fans really upset about 9-11 joke. And I'm like... 
Really? I really don't think that's true, you know. I'm, I'm not upset about it. And then there was like, um... I was re-watching a lot of the earlier episodes. They made at least two 9-11 jokes. Right, there was like, um... The Shoney's episode, right? For the, I want to say, season three opener. Uh, where Rick was escaping from prison. And he's like, there was a, uh, you know, uh, you're up between your favorite sports blooper and where you were in 9-11. And then, you know, Rick in the background, like, oh no, it's terrible. They're going to use it to take away our rights. Oh. And then the uh, Pickle Rick episode where he's like, uh, I'm a pickle and 9-11 uh, was inside job, you know. Again, two 9-11 jokes. You know, both of which, fine with. You know, and never really heard stuff like that, you know. Complaints about it, really. Come on. <laughs> but, uh, I thought it was funny that they tried to make, like, something like, you know, Cancel Rick and Morty. They made a 9-11 joke. That's too far. You know. I don't know. If I find the idea like a comedy show taking it too far is kind of hard to understand. I mean, the whole point of comedy is to push a boundary. You know, they're not. They're not there to make you feel comfortable. No, but seriously, I mean, obviously, you know, there is a, kind of a limit of what they should realistically be saying slash doing. But I don't really think the line I draw is at 9-11 jokes. Especially one where it's 9-11, no, let's not do 9-11, but a Pearl Harbor is fine. I thought it was funny. But that's just me. You know. I just think those uh, news sites like to get clicks off, you know, absolute bullshit. Because they can. And they need it, really. You know. A lot of those, um, you know, Washington Post and all that stuff, you hear a lot of people getting fired. Just the, the uh, you know, the ones hired for diversity reasons. Like, ah, I was a transgender reporter. And the entire trans department is going down at Washington Post. And it's like, uh-huh. And your job was to report specifically on trans issues? Like, what part about you being a transporter makes you any less fireable than the last guy who got fired, you know? It's just, uh, it's silly. Silly people. Silly people with silly ideals that make no sense. Silly, silly little men. Silly little green men. Ow. Skelly Bob. He's here to fight for the uh, the journalist's rights. Skeleton doesn't know any better. He doesn't have any brains, you know. I don't know. It's uh, it's kind of a joke to me at some points, you know. I don't know, right? Because like, there's a lot of stuff I, you know, can complain about, like my state's reopening, right? I don't want to go back to work. Uh, at real job, real shitty job. I mean, if I fucking wanted, I, and I kind of do want to, I'd ra rather. If I was going back to work, I'd prefer to go to a real job where I can make real money instead of the part-time job I'm working now. Just because I'm kind of done with the idea of going to school. It's it's not fun. It's not easy. Obviously, it's not easy, but, you know. I'm struggling a lot more than I thought I would because uh, I think I'm suffering from possible depression. But, you know, going to a doctor is for an idiot. No. Uh, if you're suffering from depression and you think a doctor can help, go to a doctor. Don't fucking take my advice. Trust me. Well, take my advice on that. Don't take my advice on the whole, uh, ooh, compass. On the going to the doctors is for idiots thing. That's kind of a joke. It's mostly for people who can afford it. <laughs> Which, uh, in this day and age is idiots. Ironically. Thank you, Hollywood. Ow. You know what, these aren't... What's this fucking mouse up to? Yeah, but, um, you know. If you need to see a doctor, see a doctor. I'm fucking complaining to my friend for not seeing a doctor, so... 
If I think she should see a doctor, I think you should see a doctor if you need to. If you feel you need to, right? And obviously, if you're sick, you probably don't feel like you need to. But you know, give it a give it a third person perspective. You know, don't make a decision on whether or not you want to see a doctor. Make a decision on whether or not you need to see a doctor. You know. And for now, I've got my shit handled to a bad degree, but to a degree nonetheless. Fuck off, mother slap. Fuck off. I'm not dying to you again. Oh my god. But, uh, yeah. Just, uh, want to get home in my life. You know, like doing this. It's fun. And I'm not going to stop doing this for the foreseeable future. Uh, I might take days off here and there. You know, unexplained, just because I'm not feeling the mood. But that's just how it is, isn't it? I'm doing this for majority fun. You know? I enjoy streaming. It helps me focus on games I want to complete. And, um, though, ironically, I do have a couple of uncompleted games that I am streaming currently. And have put off on because I am playing Terraria. <laughs> you know, I could be playing, uh, I could be finishing Persona, which I really need to do, because honestly, I want to be done with that game. Because Otto's trying to play the next one, I'm like, I'm not going to play the next one, so I play the first one, or the one I'm playing right now, and, you know, so on and so forth. There's also, uh, what else are we playing? I'm playing Persona, um, if you didn't hear before, I'm not going to continue Ashton here on stream. It's just, it's overall a boring game, and it's better enjoyed either maybe with friends, but even then I feel like it's not it's not really a good multiplayer game. Um, I'm not gonna get my money back for it. I, uh, I bought it on I bought it on Humble Bundle! Good sale! My only regret is I can't get all the achievements! Yeah. Uh, two, at least a couple of the achievements require you to play with friends, which uh, really fucking ruins it for me because I can't, I don't have anybody in my no one of my friends just owns the game. And, uh, I'm not gonna go, like, I, I really don't want to go around looking for people. You know? Personal preference, I don't want to spend time trying to find people to play this game with. Especially for, like, the four min four hours I need to play with some rando to, uh, to get my achievement for it. I don't know. It's an okay game. It's kind of interesting, but at a certain point, it's just repetitiveness. Like, you know, there aren't... Actually, I think, I've, I think, um, so I, I've been playing it fairly regularly because I'm, I'm having trouble sleeping and, uh, staying up watching videos and, uh, playing Astroneer because every time I lay down, I just, just fucking can't sleep. So, you know, it's better than laying in my bed awake, having fake discussions with myself that I ultimately hate. It's a fucking little shit just die. Um, yeah, it's other than that. And, you know, I wanted to complete the game. Um, they're adding stuff to it. Again, I don't know. The thing is, right, it's trying to be like a... Factorio kind of thing. I, I'm getting like an attempted Factorio vibe from what, especially with what they're adding. Because they're adding some, like, you know. Bitch, fuck off. Is just that tough, or am I just like really bad at this game? It's just a regular blood, blood sword, broad sword. There's no, you know, special modifier on it, so I guess I'm gonna take it to note. I don't know. Overall, though, right, Ashenir, uh, not not really high in my recommendation list, right? Uh, 
I feel like. Alright. Um. Just play Factorio or some shit. Like. They're adding automation, which seems like it would help. Because, like, a lot of times I'm making crap and I don't fucking know what I need, right? Like, oh, I need to make... I want to make a platform. Well, this platform requires two steel. To, uh, to make a steel, I need argon. To make argon... To get argon, I need to go back to fucking this planet, right? And, you know, after you activate the teleporter, it's not a huge deal to go back to a planet. But, like, you know, it's still fucking annoying. Like... I mean, the request platform allows you to request a bunch of shit from, you know... Oh! Okay, this figure's a different color. That's it. Is it leading to another heart, or is it a chest one? Which is why I still have the uh, brains about me. Yeah, but like, you know, it's very tedious and um, due to my forgetful nature, I tend to uh, forget which item I'm looking for, like, you know. I needed how- I wanted rubber or plastic? I wanted, you know, do I need compound or carbon or organics? Okay, well I need some more of this, so I've got to either collect dirt or- And then, you know, um, assuming I've got a whole base set up and I've managed to power up the fucking, you know, teleporter spot on the planet, you know. Um... You know, I'm able to fucking, you know, to, uh, then I spend, you know, anywhere upwards of, like, Thank you. Uh, anywhere upwards of, like, you know, an hour to two drilling to the center of the planet so I can go figure out what resource I need to go back up to the, I mean, the walk up and down, not that big of a deal, right? As long as you put it at an appropriate angle, you can slide down fairly easily and walk back up fairly easily. But, you know, not to say it's not annoying to have to figure out, you know... Ooh. Okay, so the green ones lead the chests. It's not, it's not entirely exciting, uh, I'm gonna have to fucking end soon. And I, I don't feel like it makes a very, very good stream game. Like, at least in Terraria, right, like, you know, it's, oh, I'm making a, I'm making a cave. But once the tunnel to the center of the, the you know, the elevator, that's what it is, a fucking elevator. I don't know why I'm trying to call it like, a tunnel ascent to the earth. Ooh. Fucking Jules Verne or whatever. Um, once the elevator is finished being dug, I never have to do it again, right? Tunnel's there. I know, I might need to look up resource every now and then. It's an adventure, right? It's a fun adventure that I get to do every once in a while to go collect more shit. Right? It's not, like, it's tedious. Sure, sure. Collecting more resources is always annoying, right? I always want to be have, I want to have what I need so I don't have to do it ever again. But, like, you know, that's just how life fucking works, you know? But in that game, it's only just mining and, like, it's like Minecraft, but you take out, uh, you take out the, any, any resemblance of the building aspect. 
and you're stuck and left with like you know a digging and exploration game and seriously some of the stuff looks cool like you know honestly it's you know the landscape is pretty cool i'm getting very sick and tired of however there is like a glitch and it's a known one right it's been in the game for a couple years and you kind of get just get jammed on surface like when you're walking you can just get stuck on a random bit of ground and that's it you kind of have to you have to keep do the jump to get out of it and it can happen over and over and over it's annoying right and the fucking developers knew and they added a little jetpack to make it a little bit easier to get around but it's, it's just fucking annoying when you would add an item but wouldn't try to fault solve the you know base issue i don't know maybe it's unsolvable but you know it, it's not a fun game to play on stream so uh, we'll be playing this instead of that um we need to finish persona 5 we need to finish um we gotta continue our rim world i think that's it i mean there's always the, i could finish wind waker and probably should finish wind waker I'll look at that in a little bit. Um, who knows? But uh, for now, uh, I'm being summoned by somebody. So we might be back with Overwatch. I might not stream Overwatch. We'll see. Uh, until then, though, thank you all for watching. Do like, comment, subscribe, follow on Twitch, and I will see y'all on the morrow. Bye.